little guy. Cappy. You're so happy. You're so happy. Good boy. I need to get up though. You're very sweet and I love to wake up to a purring boy, but it's time for me to get out of bed. It's just a little bit later and I'm up and moving and um, I think I mentioned it yesterday, but Haley's parents are in town. They're, they're nature people. They like to go for, for hikes and walks and stuff like that. So her and Alex and her parents are going to go for a walk and they invited us to go. So yeah, let's do that. We'll get out of the house for a little bit, walk around the lake. Enjoy the not 100 plus degree summer. Yeah. Because it's fall. Actually, and it's a little warmer than it was the other day. Yeah. So it's it seems like it's a good day for walking. <laughs> now, the best way to have a boat is to know somebody with a boat. Well, Do they saying, have the they boat club boat. here? I don't know. I'm not really cool enough to join any boat It's club. called the boat club, and it's like a VRBO boating. Oh. And then you, you, you join the club, and then you pick your boat. And, and so you have a variety of one, and you don't have to maintain it, you know? I mean... You should also maybe like introduce my parents. Oh yeah, we could do so that. You guys want to introduce yourself? You also yeah. can be like no, but yeah, you can also yeah, you can always say no. <laughs> you can always say no. <laughs> this this is Mark and Mary. This is Haley's parents. <laughs> you can see the resemblance. <laughs> I love it. I look like my mom, and I have way too many hobbies like my dad. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> that is a way to put it. <laughs> That's, that is a good description of Haley's <laughs> genetic mix. Difficult, difficult to focus. Yeah. <laughs> I like how Brandon like moved into the, the picture. In the well, I just want to give people ideas. Yeah. <laughs> There's been a lot of people that have speculated that Brandon and Haley are related. Yeah. 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 I, I mean, yeah. I have a brother, but he's older. Yeah. And Probably. lives in New Jersey. You can be honorary brother. Yeah. Sure. It's like, a good title. Like, also, my son. <laughs> it's very yeah. Yeah. It's Con have to do the yeah, yeah, wait. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Mm. A commenter's mom. mom test, and maybe we'll find a connection. We won't stress about the fictional lore too much. It's, it's fine. It's a little stressful. That was a fun little walk. We've been to Jordan Lake before and walked around, but that was a different trail than we've done before. It's also really good to see uh, Haley's parents. We've met them. Oh, I, I've met them a hand, like a few, yeah, obviously. Like multiple times over yeah. the years, but I don't know if they've ever actually been on the vlog before. Mm, I don't think they have. Maybe not. Yeah, we've met them a few times over the years. Actually, the first time. Well, no, I don't think it was the first time I ever met them. But one of the earliest times, it was before the vlog ever existed, um, I remember we went to their house. Haley wasn't even there, but, no, they offer, <laughs> but they offered to let us stay at their home. So Mal and I, like, stayed, because we were traveling through or something. I think Haley came in a day later. Yeah. Something like that. So we stayed at their home, and they, have a, they had a jacuzzi, and they were like, y'all should, like, use the jacuzzi. And I was like, okay. So we used the, the hot tub. It was really nice. Anyway, um, we're going to see them again tonight because, as I spoke about yesterday, we met up with uh, Robert Dishnet, who is commentating the event tonight that's happening in Durham. And that event is the, I'm going to do my best to get this title right. I have it right here. Do you? USA E-Baseball Finals for the WBSC E-Baseball Pro Power Pros. Power Pros is that video game that we've played a few times on Extra Life. Um, not the story mode part of it, but the, the actual like baseball part. It's very, very big in other parts of the world. It's like very, very big in Japan where it's been a series for many decades. Um, and it's, just, it's, very, it's still very niche here, mm -hmm. but these are the USA Finals and Robert is the sole commentator. So we actually got invited to this event, which is not open to the public. So it's kind of a special thing. And tonight me and Mal and Brandon and Dan and Alex and Haley and 
Haley's parents are all going to this event. I actually don't really know what to expect. Me neither. We didn't really know how to dress. We're like, how do you dress for a e esports? I think I'm gonna be slightly overdressed. Probably a little bit, but it's fine. It's fine. I'm looking forward to it. It's it's just a fun thing because I'm like, oh, this I don't know what to what exactly this is going to entail. Um, apparently, there's food, so we're gonna have some food and and watch some folks play uh, baseball. Well, digital baseball, but that's still baseball. You did it! I did it! You did it! You Holy did a great crap, job. how the hell did I do that? <laughs> <laughs> you did great. Yeah, you yeah. did great. It was oh, very, it was very, very fun to watch. Well, watch is a um, relative term. Well, it was, it was, we it was fun to watch, but we got to watch it live. Like, we got to see you say, ball go far, but like, yeah, the tape. Yeah, but like, like 20 feet away. <laughs> yes, and that was very entertaining. Yeah. Also, Robert gave us this. Do you want to explain what this is? Yeah, so so back in Singapore, I, I did the Olympic eSports series and the, the World Baseball Softball Confederation, they gave me uh, some gifts. And one of these was a, was a baseball that uh, is kind of a replica-ish of what they use in one of their Premier 12 tournaments, which is a big baseball tournament with a lot of uh, international teams in it. And so I had one of these left over and Last night, Friday night, I went to a dinner with the participants, and and I decided, you know what? It's kind of a gift to kind of kind of thank you guys for for being here. I know I kind of helped facilitate this a little bit. Yes, like... um, which that was a heck of a heck of a thing. Um, I decided to like have the participants kind of sign their names. All the participants that were in there, including myself, kind of sign their name on it and. Uh, just kind of as a kind of as a thank you gift. That's for, that's for being here. That was very very cool, and I yeah. appreciate it. And yeah. also, we really appreciate being invited to this because, like, this is a very private event, and yeah. it was a really interesting experience for us. So. Yeah, I I, I I I was hoping there would be tickets and all that, but there there weren't. But yeah. uh, that's fine. I mean, it was mainly you know USA baseball people here, families of the competitors. It was yeah. It was, it's kind of a niche event, but you know what? I'm glad that I could invite uh, some of my favorite uh, content creators and their, and their and friends. This was fun. <laughs> like, and the parents. <laughs> <laughs> I don't, this was great. Like, we just, we had this little table and we're like watching and listening and like eating. It was, it was a good time. Yeah, it was a good time. It was I, like Reptile Con. Yeah, a little like but yes. we for niche events. Yeah, we do. We like, we do. That's, 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 for niche events. If there weren't for, if it weren't for niche events, like we would not know each other. <laughs> it's true. 
I uh, I don't know if there will be another tournament like in Durham again, but I Who hope knows? so. I, I hope so too, man. Like this was this was pretty good. I mean, yeah. there there are a few things, there are a few lessons I learned from this one, but yeah. Uh, but uh, yeah, this is uh, this is pretty cool, and I thank you guys for for being here. Like this is this is fantastic. Yeah, yeah. Like, we thank, thank you for letting us in. <laughs> <laughs> I was just walking around and looking at stuff. Hi. We hate that. Oh yeah, that thing is like, a little... It's fun to stand on, but like I also felt the call of the void the entire time and I did want to drown. Wow. Yeah. It's it's neat walking around down here because like this is this is Durham. Like we don't live in Durham, we live in Raleigh. Um, and for those that are not familiar, it's uh, it's called the Triangle because there's three big cities. There's Raleigh, Durham, and Chapel Hill, which we've still never gotten a chance to go to. So um, after the event, we've just been kind of walking around and, and hanging out. We spend a lot of time just sitting in like a bar and, and chatting. Um, and it's it's neat It's because it's different. It's This isn't Raleigh. Like, we don't go to downtown Raleigh very often, but even when we do, like, it's not this. This, this has got that big thing and that. How are you doing? I'm good. I was just talking about how this is Durham and not Raleigh. It's true. Sometimes we're in the different city. Oh, they're skipping. Um, it's because they're happy. Yeah. It's uh, it's a, it's been a it's been a very good night. It's been uh, a very unique night. I yes, don't think it has. We've never had a night like this in the Raleigh Durham area. I agree with that. It's been fun to hang out with um, Haley's parents, and talk to them. We went and sat in uh, bar two different bars. Yes. I didn't, it's it's not I don't film that because yeah. it's kind of well it's like there's loud music well, and then also you're trying to live in the moment that also but I did um, Alex snapped a photo that I edited we were missing seven and it was and it was okay. it was just a really good he managed to get what is it they call it it's uh, accidental renaissance yeah, yeah. We, it was yeah. it was giving northern renaissance yeah. yeah yeah and it was a it was a cool photo so I edited it and it, it was good. It was nice. It was kind of like representative of the evening, the evening as a yeah. whole. So it's been really nice. I am a little cold. <laughs> Wish I would have worn a long sleeve shirt. Welcome to November, man. I know. It's November now. Well, that was a very fun night. I mean, it was really a, a fun day because it got started pretty early uh, going out and doing the walk. Um, but I really enjoyed myself. It was nice to get out and, and do all of that. Um, the only downside to to what happened today is that I think I walked a little bit too far. Maybe it was the fact that it was the hike because my hip is bothering me a little bit. I think it's because I did physical therapy yesterday, maybe. I don't know. I'll probably feel better tomorrow, but I'll try and take it easy and not do big walks tomorrow or anything. The sound you just heard... <laughs> It was a cinnamon roll toaster strudel, which is how I'm choosing to end off my night. Um, they were on sale at the grocery store for half off, and I was like, yeah, that's yeah, that's a good deal. I haven't had these in a while. They're a fun little snack, a little, little nostalgic for me. Actually, we were trying to get some food. We went to a McDonald's. And it was late, but we were like, we just want like just a french fry or something because we wanted a little bit more food. And uh, the the line at the McDonald's, didn't move. We were there for like four or five minutes and it did not move. And it was wrapped almost around the building. I was like, no. And then we drove to a cookout and the cookout was wrapped around the building twice. And I was like, I don't care how fast this is moving. This will take an hour if things are going well. And then we just went home and now I'm eating a toaster strudel. And that's fine. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, let's meet back tomorrow. Shall we?